Yeah, everyone typically remembers the star athlete, right? Understandably, sure. yeah. yeah. But how many of us know the athletic trainer who helps that person when they're injured? Well, University Health and Dave Campbell's Texas Football will honor the best student trainer program in San Antonio. And then this week's Kids Who Make San Antonio Great, Marvin Hurst takes us to Brackenridge High School where training is maintaining. Set. In the shadow of football drills at Brackenridge High School. We're referred to as the team behind the team. Big and tall, you want water? Student athletic trainers wait to serve. Can some water? They help me with everything. They help athletes who get the privilege to practice. The trainers being ready Damn. is always a priority. So game setup, practice setup, uh, game and practice coverage. They help me with rehab and treatment. That's for every sport on campus. No water? Erin A. Nance joined this year. At first, this was just something to just have fun with. But as I slowly started doing it more and more, it's becoming something I love. The senior quickly learned her work is more than extracurricular. It's a lot of dedication. Yeah, I'm Sam Mason. First year trainer. Serena Aguignon saw a chance to move the ball toward her dream of becoming a physical therapist. And I just have that natural instinct of, oh, they need help. I need to go help them. I just love helping people. Good, good, 24 members make up the group. We have two of them who are football players, three of them are volleyball players. We have some in color guard. Four boys and 20 girls willingly committed to these duties. We don't teach sports medicine as a class, so yes, all of our athletic training students are volunteers. Good, good, paddle, paddle. Football is their most demanding good, 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 sport. Paddle, paddle. Injuries are likely, even at practice. One time we had an injury with a dislocation, and he was, he was in real bad pain, and it was really scary to watch him go through all that pain because he was screaming and crying for help. The group's contributions don't typically get recognized. Recently, though, the visibly invisible members who stand near the blare of a coach's command won the Student Trainer Program of the Week. I was so happy about that. Their dedication qualifies them for $2,500 in Program of the Year. Because we're always in the background. No one pays attention. No one really knows what we do. Over Delta. Few get to Over see the Delta. healing from this squad off the field. There are things that tape can't hold in place. So we have a few kids who lost parents within the last year. So they come to Chris and myself, you know, when they need that kind of parent. Um, we have a lot of kids who are just dealing with stuff here at school that you know, they don't want to talk to their parents about, but they need somebody to vent to. So in those moments where the sideline can make one feel like a hidden figure, <laughs> there's always an open spot on a team that cares. Yeah, it's a lot more than just athletic training. It's a lot more than just sports medicine and physical therapy. Marvin Hurst, Kins 5, Eyewitness News. Well, fans will decide in an end-of-the-year vote if Brackenridge can beat Harlandale, John Jay, Holmes, Burbank, Southwest, Judson, McCollum, Highlands, and Brandeis. Good it's luck to them. Field. Yeah, <laughs> it is. Wow. They do good work. Yep, take some uh, dedication, long hours, I'm sure. Certainly feeling a little more like football weather now, isn't it, Paul? Oh, oh it is, yeah. You know.